was telling you, you got those numbers here. You loosen this up to put it in or out. When that's loose and you press that, then you can take the camera out. You see that? Now it's back to normal. You pull that up. This is loose. Make sure this is loose. Press this and slide the camera in. Okay? And tighten it back up. Now, you see, the camera just go like, it goes like that. So the first balancing thing you want to do is for your camera to be standing. In the, this is the first balancing process you want to go through for your camera to be standing straight going straight so this is our first step what we are gonna try to do so by doing that let me try and push it all the way back I'm gonna release this back so I can move it now I already tightened it so I couldn't move it so I take it all the way back you see now go it was in front there you, you see the balancing process now it goes in front depends on how you pushing it so now we try to find the middle ground now it's still in front so we need to go a little bit more backwards still in front a little bit more now it's going the back, so that's in between. Bring it up in front just a little bit. Now it's going backwards. Now let's see if moving it back and forth, because we got pretty much in between kind of thing going. Then we release it, push it in front a little. Maybe that, ooh, that's too much. Maybe that helps. Okay. Now it's back and front, so that was too much. This is what you got to go through, basically. Okay. Now it's been through. Now let's try moving it sideways. Now, you see that? Okay, now it's better to move it in. I can see the reaction already. Move it in. Aha. Uh -huh. You see we're getting somewhere? You see that? See that little tit up there? You want to be able to have it whereby it's standing. So that's basically now we've got a grip on it. Tighten it. So we got a grip on it this way. So now we got the first balancing part. The first part, you see I was going back and forth. You think it's an impossibility? It's actually possible. Now you got the first part balanced. Exactly. So once you can push it and you know it's going to stand, you got it balanced, that's all right. So we go to part five, the next step. So the forward mode is balanced, as we can see right there. But now you need to balance this part because it's not balanced. So how do you do that? This knob right here, this is for the front part to balance it. This is for the second part to balance it. If you release this, you can move this back and forth to balance it. So this is the part. See? We got lucky right there and it's balanced. We got lucky right there and that's the balance so tighten it. And this part you don't need anything once that's tightened you know that's tightened. So we got lucky right there so that's balanced. It's balanced on the whole. That was a little bit quicker than I expected. So it's still balanced on the upward level. Let's see. Yeah. And it's balanced on the so now we're going to the next the third balancing point so we want to do the tilt balance like I said this is unlock and it's tilting so and I've already adjusted the and the only way to do that you have to go back to this and I hope when we do that that's still not so we can move this plate 
and we've already set that for the top so it's still tilting towards this side let me see if by adjusting the level where it's hanging that helps so I'm gonna lose this and hang it down a little see it that helped that helped and let me see if but that's hanging all the way to the bottom let me see if I lose this way lose the screw on the bottom and move this a little bit here now it's tilting so but that was the right adjustment so we we'll move it back let me see if I can move that arm up a little so that helps move it down yep it's sitting on it that helps and we lock it that's unlocked that's locked and lock it back so that's locked so that part is balanced so now we're going to go to the last one